asking, how do you know if your dog has been exposed to a Bufu toad? Okay. Well, Bufo toads are quite common here in Florida. We've all seen them. They like it when it's nighttime, when it rains. They like pools, lake fronts. Um, they're brown, ugly, horny toads, if you will. Um, usually the first indication I worry about is a dog comes into the home, he's out on a walk, and he begins to profusely salivate. And as a result, the first, the first thought you have is he was bitten because these toads have poison in the glands in the skin. So all they have to do is bite it. They don't have to eat it. They don't have to swallow it. They bite it. And that's going to be the first thought. Now, sometimes dogs can eat other things and just taste things, and it will result in hypersalivation. It will result in you know, profusely salivating. It doesn't have to be a toad, but that's the first indication. The first thing you need to do is to rinse the mouth out very thoroughly. Grab a hose, go to the kitchen sink, and rinse it out, and then, of course, call the vet right away. Po toad poisoning is very serious. Um, it does lead to neurological disease and it can cause death. So first thing, notice the salivation. It means they may have been exposed. Rinse the mouth out, call the doctor, and uh, we'll get to it right away. Thank you.